Who's next, John? Bob, it's Linda Parker. Come on down. You're the next contestant on the prize. He's right. <laughs> Linda Parker, how do you do? Look what we're going to bid on now. A new color TV. A 25-inch diagonal video high-tech color TV. A Zenith System 3 with stereo amplifier, advanced space phone, on-off programmer, and computer space command remote control. Linda, will you start the bidding on that, please? 1,000 even. 1,000 even. Anna? 1,200. $1,200, Ronald? Uh, 1450 1450 Cynthia? 1100 $1,100. Actual retail price, 1495 Ronald, you own it. Now, Ronald, I have something that you could use if you decide eventually to buy your wife a birthday gift. John, would you tell him what we have in store for him? Indeed so. You're going to play Plinko with a chance to win up to $25,000 in cash. $25,000. Will you join me back here at the Plinko board, please? Now, I am going to give you this single Plinko chip. With that, you could win $5,000, but I'm gonna give you a chance to win four more and four prizes, too. John, what's the first prize with the first chip? Well, first, Con Air Screw Reflections, a professional's choice. Lighted makeup mirror has four light settings, adjustable wing mirrors for panoramic view. To win that prize and win a Plinko chip, tell me, is the four that you see there the first number in the price of that prize, or is the zero the last digit in the price? Four is the first number. The four is the first number. Is he a winner with that? He sure is. $44. You have another chip, you have the prize. All right, John, let's go on. Now we have Norelco 12-cup Dial-A-Brew coffee maker that has a built-in 24-hour analog clock and timer from Norelco Dial-A-Brew. Are you gonna go with the three as the first number or the eight as the last? Go with the eight. He wants the eight as the last number and he's right again, it's $58. John, what's next? Next, Norelco 12-cup Dial-A-Brew coffee maker. No, we have Black & Decker's Collector, the powerful handheld vacuum with a long cord to pick up where big backs leave off the collector from Black & Decker. And is the first number right, the five, or is the second number right, the six, the last number in the price? Go with the five. Goes with the five, and he wins again. John, there's one more, what is it? It's Nylon Steel Toys. Since 1946, built to last. Lots of play value for boys and girls. Made with care to give with love. Nylon. Is five the first number or zero the last bit? The zero. The zero. How about it? It's a clean sweep. You have all five Plinko chips. Step right over there to the foot of the stairs. Well, I'll tell you how to play it. He says, how do I play this? How do I play this? You take all of those, go up those steps now, behind that board up there. When you look down from up there, you can see numbers there. You see 5,000 here, 1,000 here, and so on. Now, that is what you win if the Plinko chip ends up in that slot. $1,000 there, zero there. Stay away from that. Now, the thing to do is to hold the chip flat against the board. Just put it, hold it flat, then release it. It'll come down through those pegs, and you end up in one of the slots, and that's what you win. Look at this strategy. Here it comes, ladies and gentlemen. And it's headed for $5,000, and he got it. $5,000 to start with. And he has four Plinko chips left. All right, Ronald. Go right ahead. Here it comes again, folks. And it is moving over toward the middle. And it... Oh, my zero... John, Ronald, try again. Boom, bang, crash, and... Uh, oh, that was a spit $1,000! That was a speedy one. He has a total of $6,000 with two chips to go. What's going to happen to Ronald? Already his wife can have a lovely birthday gift. Amen. And... It is another zero. 
All right, you have one Plinko chip left, don't you? Get it into that 5,000 slot. 6,000 total so far. Let's make it 11. Here it comes, folks. It's a possibility. Oh! Well, Ronald, you did all right. You won $6,000. It was well worth the effort. Happy birthday to your wife. Merry Christmas to both of you. Showcase showdown number two after we do a little business with you.